I'm a Borata from Kazakhstan. High five! High five! So we got ourselves some electrical eel. We've never tried this before. We found this in Romlom. Guillermo uh, just spotted it in a nearby restaurant. So we got the eel from there and now the rice in this restaurant because you guys are having something else. Uh, we're gonna try eat this and not and try not to be electrocuted on the way. There's some dots on it. I think Guillermo's food looks much better. His yeah. plate looks much better. Presentation. 10 out of like 10. some dots there. Yeah. Electrical eel. Alright. Oh, it's not meat. I can see like, uh, you can see it's like, like white meat. Kind of looks like, I don't know, like uh, catfish. Try it. Mm. Tastes good? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of bones. Tastes good. What do you think? It's good, but it's, it's, weird. it's weird. It's like gooey. Yeah. Ah. It's gooey. Yeah. It was not what I was expecting at all. And the skin looks like a snake snake skin. We can, uh, That's pretty weird. Oh. It's fish, right? It's like fatty. It's good. The sauce is coconut with chilies. It's like a normal Asian, Asian um, coconut curry. It's good. And now our dishes have arrived. Yeah. Noodles, pancit, what? Panton or something. It's noodles. A cabbage. Sprite noodles with vegetables. We go for the safe option, right? Safe. <laughs> safe option. Typical fried noodles. They're not very typical, they're quite different. They got a Filipino twist? Yeah, Filipino twist. Very nice. This sauce, as Madalena was saying, is very good. Sweet, nice. Thank you. One time on the box. Just finishing the, the eel. It was good, but maybe I would not order that again. Because it's got too many bones and it's quite hard to actually eat the meat. But I'm glad that we tried it and maybe we won't have many opportunities to, to eat that again. So happy. You happy, Guillermo? I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> we are happy too. With our noodles, we're really happy. Uh -huh. Bon Bon Beach, here we are. We're coming again. Our day, our days have been spent on this beach, snorkeling and just spending some time with our new friends. We're gonna introduce them to you guys in a minute. And now we're gonna find a nice spot to snorkel and to put our stuff. We're gonna spend the whole afternoon here. Here he comes, coconut man, coconut man, coconut man. You got water? But I don't think we'll. No, I water. don't know. All right, let me quickly introduce you to our new friends in Romblom. This Hello. is Guillermo. <laughs> I'm Guillermo from Spain. <laughs> from España. I'm enjoying here in Romblom. And this is Magdalena. Hello, Magdalena from Poland. From Poland, Sin Dobre. <laughs> It's hard. Yes, the personal people is that. <laughs> Look at the crowds gathering around to help us. 
eat our coconut. <laughs> Alright, we got the skin out. Ah, oh. Salamat. Oh, Salamat. Now this one. <laughs> Thank you. Salamat. Salamat. Can we? We're gonna take your weapon. Is that okay? Thank you. Thank you, my friends. Salamat po. Salamat. <laughs> Now we've got the easy part to ourselves. <laughs> oh. <Probably not>. nice. <laughs> Open a coconut with a coral, a dead coral. <laughs> okay. Go on, you try go, it. Go first. How is it, man? Yummy. <laughs> <laughs> With pieces of a stone, man. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, it's the same as the fresh one. Oh, it's very heavy. Mm. Not the same. This one. The girl that didn't like coconuts before coming oh, to Asia. Oh, it's nice. It's nice. You enjoy coconut now? Mhm. Mm it's full. Now it's for you. What is your name? Angela. Wow. Beautiful color. Beautiful. We are on the island, so there's plenty of coconuts and we have them all for free, as many as we want. We just made some new friends, what's your name? An Angelo? Aljor. Aljor. And we got Justin. Say hello, Justin. Justin is the one on the floor. Which one? The one on the floor. It's the blue shirt one, Justin. <laughs> oh! Dragon Filipina, yeah. And what's your name? Marco. Marcangelo. <laughs> it's time to do some snorkeling. We managed to find a way with this case and use Christiana's iPhone. Plus Guillermo and Madalena, they've got an action cam. So we're gonna use this also to do some water footage. Pretty excited to finally get those shots. <laughs> You can barely see it on the sun. Okay, 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 okay. Now softly around. We can just take it like this? Watch, yeah, but watch. Yeah. Whoa. And then you have to wash in the, with the sea water. We just caught a sea urchin and we are just about to eat the insides. It kind of looks like the eggs, but I don't think it's the eggs. You, but you just see this part. What you saw us was cleaning the insides, and this yellow, yellowish orange bit is the bit that you eat. Terrible. How is it? Nice? Mm -hmm. Like seafood. Mm -hmm. It's good. You want to try? Yeah, difficult to get. Oh, that's a big chunk of meat. Mm. It's nice. And no day goes by without us being on the beach and having mangoes. <laughs> Typical now. Typical us now. Mangoes, guys. 
mango. Thank you. We've been coming here every night for this because I just love this pork with egg and rice and I think this is a hot plate so they put it on the, on the fire and the plate is super hot and the meat and the egg and it's just It's delicious. called zingling or zing? Zingling sing sick. Zingling sick. That's it. And it's your ultimate favorite food here I know. in this island? Uh, it is. My favorite food ever. And then we just did this. Because the egg is a bit raw, as you can see. But the plate is super hot, so it's gonna cook everything nicely. It might not look good, but it's delicious. So we are finishing our video over here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. So goodbye. See you. Good night. <laughs> Bye.